Hey, Sean. This is not a review of the Hudson Spider Mosey. This is more of an introduction, both for myself and for you, if you're not familiar with this light or you're, you're thinking about getting it. The, the Hudson Spider company makes two lights. They make the red back, which is this giant eight-legged light where each of the legs or arms articulates and you can bend them flat, back, whatever. And then they release this smaller version called the Mosey, which has six arms, but they bend and articulate just the same way. And this gives you a lot of flexibility versus your, your standard two different types of lights where you have either a single source hard light, like any of your aperture, um, 120D, 300D, 600D, my hive lights, the 200CX in the background. And then you've also got like big LED panels, like your sky panels um, from Ari, or even the aperture has a new big panel. Um, and sort of similar to the quasar tubes, like the two foot tube I have overhead and I have another four foot quasar tube. But this light is none of those things. It's an LED light that you can shape in different ways. And so you can bounce this thing into umbrellas, you can shine it through diffusion, you can do a lot of different things with it, but also using it raw creates a really cool natural light. And so that's what's hitting me right now. This is in raw mode. It's set to about 8% of its power and it's about another foot and a half away from my fingertips. So it's, it's about four and a half, five feet away from my face. And with no diffusion whatsoever, this is the light it's casting on me. And so as somebody who's often setting up interviews, the pain is having to also set up soft boxes, light domes, whatever, to make the light usable or to bring a massive LED panel like, like a sky panel or a Kino Celeb or something like that. This folds up into this little canister and it fits in a Pelican 1605 that I use that also holds my hive light and my quasars. It's, it's that small and yet it folds out into this really usable, simple light. And when you're trying to be lean and capable, I know there's other ways to get light like this, but it involves using multiple sources, probably using like an eight by eight diffusion panel, which takes multiple stands and sometimes multiple people to get set up properly and quickly. I screwed a baby pin into the back of this and put it on one C stand, plugged it in with one cable, and this is the light coming off of it. So as far as somebody like me who does things, usually interview based in, in pretty quick situations, this is fantastic and I'm excited to really stress test it in the field. And I'll show you, here are some other configurations that you can use the light in. This is the Mosey spread out into flat mode, shining into a seven foot silver lined umbrella and coming back at me. And so it's a huge source with a ton of wrap uh, and it creates this light on me. And this is at about 12% power. This is the Mosey shining straight upward into the seven foot silver umbrella and it's cascading down over me. The, I'm touching the light right now. And so it's pointing straight up and coming back down and it creates this kind of light. This is the Mosey shining toward me, but through a seven foot white diffusion umbrella. So it's not bouncing off anything, it's just coming through the white diffusion umbrella at my face. And I've also used the light in an overhead setting to do some product photography, both in the raw parabolic LED mode and bouncing up into an umbrella. And I was really impressed with the quality of the light both times as I ran those tests. So this isn't a review of the light yet. I haven't really put it through proper professional paces. But these are my initial reactions uh, and I'm pretty excited. And so if you have anything that you're interested to see whether or not this light can do, please throw it in the comments and I'll make sure to include that as I really stress test this light in the field. Um, and I will answer any questions that I can answer at this point uh, as you have them. So thanks for watching. I'm not paid to do any of this. I bought this light for full price. The customer support was fan. Fantastic. I cannot say enough good things about how well they handle things, especially by contrast, uh, pun intended, to some other lighting companies I've worked with. Um, so huge fan of this company, huge fan of this product so far, uh, and I'm excited to, to continue to learn how to use it because this is a better light than I am a producer, and it's definitely capable of more than I am. Uh, and, and that's a fun place to be in because it allows me to grow as a producer and try things that I wouldn't have been able to do without a light like this. So thanks for watching. Again, any questions, throw them in the comments and I'll do my best. See you later, bye.